Hi, this is Taylor Hendry, and you're watching Hibernian TV. Taylor, congratulations on that hat-trick against Burnt Island Shipyard last week in the East of Scotland League. What are your thoughts on that? Yeah, obviously it's good to get a few goals and the win's the most important thing, but for myself it's good to get playing because through injury I've not played a lot, so it's good to get a few games and try to get myself uh, on the bench with the 20s or even starting, so that's my main, main aim just now. Because obviously you arrived here at Hibs in the summer from Ipswich Town, but then obviously you were dealt a bit of a hammer blow with uh, that injury. What was the full extent of that problem? Just always just pre season, just done it straight away. When I was at Ipswich, I done my, tore my calf in pre season, so pre season isn't the best time for me. But you know, it's just one of those things you've got to deal with and come back stronger, and that's what I'm trying to do just now. What was the injury? I uh, broke my fifth metatarsal in my left foot. So, how long did that keep you out for? I think it was about five months, five and a half months, kept me out. So, quite a long time, a large part of the season. But obviously, I just want to get back playing, and yeah. that's what I'm doing. So. How frustrating was that, especially seeing someone like Jason Cummings who'd arrived at the same time, uh -huh. suddenly end up in the, in the first team and playing in, in, in a, in a Bredard? It's, it's frustrating and it's, it's good as well to see Jason because sometimes you think, oh, that could have been me if I wasn't injured, but it's good to see Jason do that and hopefully it gives confidence for me and other players to do that. So it's, it's all good. Like. So you started off at Ipswich Town, a bit like the manager, Terry Butcher, okay. but your accent is an Edinburgh one. Uh, tell our viewers a bit more about your background in the game. Yeah, I was born in London, so, uh, came up here, lived all my life in Scotland, played for uh, Hutchie Vale, same as Jason, and a few of the other boys, and uh, went from there to uh, Ipswich for a year, and then came here. Does it help the fact that you knew a few of the boys from Hutchie Vale then? Yeah, well, I've known Jason for a few years, I knew him when he was at Hearts. And I knew some of the other boys like Jamie Beaton and you and Smith went to the same school with him, so it was good coming in and seeing them, those boys because they, they helped me through it really for the first few weeks to get to know everyone, so it was good. Obviously you, you scored against Gabala FK in the uh, trip to Turkey <laughs> and that's obviously just set the, the wheels in motion now for hopefully a productive second half of the season. Yeah, it was, it was a good trip, uh, two weeks in Turkey. It was good to see what other teams in Europe were like. They, they weren't the best team, but get a good few, few goals in my name and then come back here and get another few goals. That's, that's the main thing. So it's now just a case of trying to press for a, a starting spot in the under-20 team in the SPFL under-20 league? Yeah, that's the main thing. I want to get, get some game time because I've not, as I said, I've not played a lot in the 20s. I've only, I think I've played two or three games and not been in a few of the squads. So the main thing for me is when I do get my chance on the Saturday, I want to keep playing, keep scoring, 